the big winner tonight. He is undefeated in the squared circle. No one beats us to the punch. What's up, Bare Knuckle News fans? It's Big Boy, and I'm here in Tampa with our man, David Simpson. Dave, you came out here and fought. It didn't go your way, but Dave, you're a fighter, and you always bring it like you did tonight. Tell us, what's a little bit of thoughts going through your head right now? You know, I mean, it was, it was a pretty good fight, you know, but main thing is he should, you know, should have let me finish that round. You know, he stunned me. Uh, you know, I lost the second of time, but I was on my feet, and I wasn't wobbling. And, uh, you know, I'll say when the fight's over, if I can still continue, you know. So it hurts to lose like that, but everyone seems to be positive with me, and I just want to be out here soon. Yeah, yeah you know, Dave, you're, you're an, an absolute great fighter. We loved watching you fight uh, Scott in the last fight. We, you saw some battles with us, and you're a warrior, and we continue to like to see you fight. Tell us, what are you going to do now when you go back to the lab? Is training camp going to keep going the same, and, and when are you going to start fight ready for your next fight? Yeah, man, I mean, I'm, I'm going to fight as soon as I can. I mean, you know, I put everything in the bare knuckle. I fought the number one guy tonight, and I came up short, and it hurts. But, um, you know, I still could have won. And, you know, we, we had some stuff problems with my coaching in the corner. They didn't like uh, my coach on the on the, on the the FaceTime and stuff. They started, they kind of pulled out the coach in the last couple rounds. But uh, we'll get all that straight. And, you know, I could have won the night. I just did it. And, uh, you know, I'll keep getting more experience, and I'm not going anywhere. Yeah. You know, spoken from a true warrior, never defeated. Uh, one of the things I like to tell the fighters is a coach can't really teach you to win or lose. They can only teach you how to fight, and it's up to you to do either one. Dave, you proved that you're a tough fighter tonight. Any sponsors, friends, or your coach that you'd like to thank? Hey, I'd like to th uh, thank my coach, Jason Williams. You know, I'm sorry I came up short tonight. He puts a lot of time into me, probably between 6 and 12 hours a week. And, uh, you know, he believes in me a lot and thinks I'm, you know, I can be a champ. You know, it just hurts that I didn't get it tonight. You know, this is a big fight for me. Like I said, I wanted that guy's spot. But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to start, I'm going to be training Monday. And I'm going to be trying to get out here as soon as I can. You know, I banged up a little bit. I was in a fist fight, but I'm not hurt, I don't think. And I should be ready to go soon. You heard it from him, folks. He's ready to come back at it. And that's the spirit of a fighter. Big boy here in Tampa with our man, David Simpson. We're with Bare Knuckle News. No one beats us to the punch.